How Super Shock Gains Its Powers The first episode is called Shock in the System and shows several important characters in the story. Among them, the protagonist, Virgil Hawkins, a 14-year-old boy and his family, Sharon his sister who he is always fighting, and his father Robert. At school we also met Richie, his best friend who gives tips on how to get close to a girl. When Virgil works up the courage to do so, Francis stops him and almost beats the hero up but is saved by Wade, an acquaintance. Returning home, the protagonist is once again faced with the bullying, this time with his friends who beat him mercilessly until Wade appears again to help him and then asks Virgil to meet him under a bridge in half an hour. Even complaining, Virgil goes to the place and finds Wade where the character comments that he will not always be there to protect him, offering him a place in his gang. Without giving a concrete answer, the boy returns home saying that his injuries came from football. While she thinks of a way to refuse the invitation, since her mother was killed by a conflict between two rival gangs, the boy receives a call from Wade telling him to go to a dock. Arriving there, Wade gives Virgil a gun to prepare for the confrontation against Francis' group. The protagonist then realizes what is happening and throws the gun away to try to escape. At that moment the police arrive ordering everyone to stop. The two gangs don't listen and then a helicopter hits the containers in the place resulting in an explosion that emanates a purple gas. He wakes up at home the next day, happy to be safe, but with an unexplained fever. Deciding to get up, he goes to the bathroom to shave and the blades then start to make a noise where the hero realizes that he is releasing electricity. Excited, he calls Richie asking him to meet him at a junkyard and shows his skills to his friend. With that, the two begin to create a uniform and Virgil defines the name of Super Shock. Finally, the episode ends showing Francis with fire powers.